Now, if you follow me on Twitter, or if you just follow me at mealtime, you know my love for Waffle House. You know, I actually feel sorry for people who live up north or out on the West Coast where they may not even have a Waffle House. Because the food is delicious, it's served fast, it's the best value for your money. Honestly, I get hungry just talking about it. Well, I recently sat down for a smothered and covered conversation with Waffle House CEO, Walt Emer to learn more about this iconic American restaurant. Watch. Well, Walt, I think we can get our mask off now that we've got the food on the way, because it's hard to eat with one of these things it is, on, isn't it? It is hard to eat, so uh, thank you. Oh, that looks great. Thank you, Keisha. You know, Waffle House is my happy place. I eat at Waffle Houses all over the country where they are, and I wouldn't live in a state that didn't have one. There's something wrong with locations that don't have a Waffle House. We tell people if they if they want one and we're not there, they, they probably should move. They, and I think you've said the same thing. I so. totally agree with that. I think a lot of people, if they know Waffle House, they know it's consistent. The menu's gonna be the same no matter what Waffle House you're in. The building will look pretty much the same. Uh, the food's gonna be great. It's gonna be served quick, hot. The price point is very, very affordable, inexpensive, great value. What's not to love? Well, I tell you, I think the thing that actually makes us special are the people. And, you know, we try to make all these variables the same everywhere so you can start from the same place. But the people in each location are what make each individual Waffle House special. And we tell people all the time, we're really not a chain of restaurants. We're a collection of a lot of individual restaurants that just do the same thing. And the people in every one of our restaurants are, are what make us special. You got a member of Congress uh, from South Carolina who's uh, really becoming famous because yeah. she dropped out of high school, went to work at a Waffle House, and then worked her way through college and now is going to Congress. That ain't bad. No, she's doing pretty well for herself, <laughs> isn't she? So. But, and she loved her story of Waffle House. She learned how to work hard. Yeah. What a great testament to, the, I think, the quality of what you try to put together. Our people are some of the greatest people in this country, and they they work hard, they care for their customers, they care about each other, and some people come for a little while to get themselves started on something in life, and some people come and stay. But there's plenty like her that started and moved on, so. Waffle House is as old as I am. 65 years 65. you guys have been in business. How did it start? So in 1955, two neighbors started the business in a suburb of Atlanta. And they had this theory that they wanted to work with their friends and, uh, and start a little business. And so it started slow. Uh, one restaurant the first year, a second restaurant the second year, and they grew it very slowly over time, making sure they were getting it right. When I was governor, when we had disasters, tornadoes, floods, whatever it might be, we knew that FEMA Region 6 would determine how bad the catastrophe was by what they call the Waffle House test. This was real, and a lot of people think I was kidding when I tell them this, but it was real. If the Waffle House was running regular hours, if everything was normal, then it's a manageable catastrophe. If they were on modified hours, this is pretty bad. We better bring some assets together. If for any reason Waffle House was closed, all hands on deck. This is the mother of yeah. all disasters. We feel the same way. <laughs> <laughs> One of the things that I always loved is that you do get to see it being made. And I'm always amazed that you have the servers and the cooks and this stuff is going on and they get it right. I mean, it's unbelievable that they're yelling out the orders and you know, and you're thinking there's no way they're gonna get this right, but they do. It seems like chaos, but there's actually a system to it all. The best part is they, when they're working together as a team, they really, they really know, you know, kind of play off each other's moves in essence and help each other out. And that's, that's when it all comes together perfectly. We can't let this food get any colder. We should get started. No, absolutely not. What a delight to get to be here. And yeah. thanks for making Waffle House not just for me, but for a lot of people, our happy place. Well, thank you. Thank you for being such a great customer over the years. We've uh, we've enjoyed doing business with you. I hope we can for years to come, so. Count on it. All right, great. Thank you, Governor. Thank you. All right.
All right, Trey and Keith, I oh. noticed both of you guys watching mm. that segment with food envy in your eyes. Uh. So the good folks at Waffle House sent over some takeout for yeah. both of you guys and brought me some. Mm -hmm. uh, Keith, yeah. what'd you and Trey get? What did you all have? I got a ham and cheese omelet here that's Ooh. divine. Yep. Looks pretty good. I'm, I'm going to eat while you talk. Trey, did you get the, anything? This is the best idea we've ever had on It is the show. best idea we've ever had. I mean, had. this is a really oh. good idea. You know, I the only bad waffle. thing, though, all the audience, they're really unhappy with us because we're sitting mm -hmm. here eating Waffle House food, and they're not. I feel real mm. guilty. I yeah. feel terrible. <laughs> and the band, I, I don't. I love you. I don't feel don't bad fear. at all. I'm real guilty. Waffle House more, has more than 2,100 locations all over the U.S. I've been at most of them. There's even a Waffle House <laughs> Museum that you can visit. Now, if you want to visit with me, people say, hey, I'd like to meet with you somewhere. All right, easy. Just go to a Waffle House. I'll be there soon, okay? You can also learn more at wafflehouse.com.